This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello, I'm Jim Patton with this ABC 10 News update. This weekend's excessive heat is raising concerns of potential power outages and fire conditions. California Independent System Operator announcing a flex alert to ease strain on the power grid. SDG&E is asking customers to run major appliances overnight or in the morning and set air conditioners at 78 degrees or above to save energy. Governor Newsom also signing an emergency proclamation to free up extra energy and hopefully avoid any major power shutoffs. Meanwhile, firefighters are warning everyone to stay vigilant to avoid setting any major fires. With a hot holiday weekend in store, that means more San Diegans will likely turn to the beach to beat the heat. So lifeguards are preparing and they are maxing out staff across all beaches starting today. They say social distancing won't be enforced, but they still want everyone to follow the rule. San Diego County just got off the watch list a couple of weeks ago, so this is to continue the county's trajectory in the right direction. San Diego was put on the state's monitoring list July 5th, right after our last big holiday weekend. Uh, happening tomorrow, the San Diego Museum of Art officially reopens to the general public. The museum has been closed since March and was scheduled to reopen July 9th, but those plans were scrapped after the county laid out new guidelines. The museum has made some changes for the reopening and they will operate at limited capacity with temperature checks and social distancing and everyone must wear a mask. All right, we've been talking about that heat. Let's get right out to Megan and get the details here. Hey, Megan. That's right. We are in an excessive heat warning now for the inland mountain and desert areas that will last through Labor Day. The coast has one more nice day before they join in on that excessive heat warning that lasts through Labor Day. So 70s and 80s along our coast, 90s and triple digits inland and in the mountains and right about 115 in the deserts. Tomorrow and Sunday, coastal areas will be soaring into the 90s while temperatures inland will be hovering right about 110. And just earlier this morning, a red flag warning has been issued for the inland neighborhoods to the mountains from 10 a.m. Saturday until 6 p.m. Sunday for the excessively hot temperatures, gusty dry winds up to about 35 miles per hour and humidity down to about 10 percent, leading to critical fire danger this weekend. Jim? Yeah, we all have to be careful. All right, Megan, thank you very much. And for the latest news, weather, and traffic, go to 10news.com or download our free 10 News mobile app in your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Jim Patton.